this video is going to be bar again, and all you need is your chair and a mat. So to start with, your right leg in front of you, keep it straight and low, and just pulse it up. You want to lock your knee. When you lock the knee, then your quads work hard. You want to pull your abs in and lean forward towards the leg just a little, so you're not leaning into your lower back. See if you can lift a little higher. We're warming up right now. So you don't want to go too high, but don't do your minimum. Try to find something in between how high you can go and how low you can go, just in the middle. Bring it down and switch. Pull up. It's a rainy day. And my dog is scratching. Any minute she'll come and join me. Keep on locking that knee. Keep your abs tight. Open the chest. Press the shoulders down your back. Keep lifting that leg. You should feel the muscles warming up. It's a good thing. And as the muscles warm up, you're going to start to breathe a little heavier. I am playing Gypsy Kings. I hope you like it. I love Spanish music. Take it down and switch. Bring your right knee up. Pull your abs all the way in and lift. Remember that when you lift your leg, your hamstrings have to stretch. Hamstrings will pull on your glutes and your lower back. So if you feel it in your lower back, then lower the leg a little. But we're pulsing, warming up still. You can keep your arms out if you want. Just holding your arms up is going to work them. Bring it down and switch. We're gonna do this together. It's going to be so good. Hopefully you'll feel your legs, your booty, your hamstrings, your calves. So we'll get down on the mat and do super wonderful core work. Makes me want to dance. Take it down and switch. You're going to take your right leg up again. Little circles. Okay, so if you feel you're going to lose your balance, use your chair. Put one hand on the chair. But whatever you do, Try to not go trotting across the room and then trip yourself. That would not be good. Reverse it. Just put the foot down. If you feel, ah, you're going to lose your balance like I just did, or hold on to the chair. Yeah, we all lose our balance, but you know what happens when you try to balance? You strengthen the standing leg. This leg right now is holding you up. So your ankle is working, the quads, the glutes, everything. To get down and switch. Little circles. As you circle the leg, you'll feel the inner thigh, the quads, and the glutes. All the muscles that are pulling your leg to the left and the right and up. Don't you want to dance to this music? It's okay to break out into a dance and reverse it. This is just a workout. So if dancing makes you sweat, then do it. Ah, lampada. I remember those days. Okay, take it down. Bring the arms behind your back and open the chest. And get down on your mat. Hopefully it's close by. Bring your knees out wide and your feet together. And the hands a little wider than your shoulders. Take your body down so you're almost on the mat and then pulse it. Keep your abs super tight, relax your back, bring the feet in. So all of your body weight right now is being supported by your arms. You should feel your chest, your abs, your shoulders, and your arms. Did I say arms twice? I did. Keep going. Bring it, bring it all the way up. Bring the knees together, sit back. Interlace the fingers behind your back and then lift. Drop the crown of your head, feel the stretch in the front of the shoulders and the chest. And then bring your arms down. Come up into down dog. So you want to make sure that you lift your tailbone up towards the ceiling. Keep your back flat. Draw the shoulder blades down your back. 
bring the right leg all the way up, that contracts your glutes, move forward into a plank, and bring the knee in. And then go back out, bring forward, bring the knee in. So you're moving back, stretching the front of the leg and contracting the back of the leg. Bring it in, contracting your abs and stretching your glutes. And again, all the way up, and then in. Inhale and exhale deeply, try to not hold your breath. Try to exhale through your mouth. Bring it down and stretch. My chair is in the way. I'm gonna move it back a little. And then come up, we're gonna switch side, curl your toes under. Push your hips back, open your chest. Bring the left leg all the way up. And then move your body forward and bring the knee in. And then again, all the way up, knee in. You should feel this in your obliques and your glutes. Your arms, your chest, your shoulders, upper back muscles. Oh yes. And bring it down. Sit back. And then come. I'm going to fix my pants. Go out with your knees and keep your feet together. Bring your arms in front. Sit back on your heels and come up. When you come up, contract your glutes and back of upper thighs. This seems like nothing until all of a sudden you'll feel it. Contract your glutes, open the chest. Keep your arms right here or on your chest. Actually, let's keep them here. You want to go back without breaking at the waist. So keep a straight line from your head to your knees. You should feel your quads and your glutes, and then come forward. Again, go back and come forward. That's two. Remember, every time you 
try to do something that's challenging. Your body is figuring it out and getting stronger. So you can do three repetitions, take a break and do three more. And eventually you'll do the whole thing. It'll feel easier. You feel it? You feel it? Hold it. I'm going to bring my hands up front so you can see. Bring the leg up to the side and lift. Two. Make sure the leg is behind you and not to the side. If you can see from the corner of your eye, your knee, then the leg is to your side. Try to move it back. Try this everything. Pick it up and let's pulse it up. So this is your right leg. Mine is my left leg. My left leg is weaker. I already feel this. Does not feel good. It feels awkward and it hurts a little. Remember to squeeze the glutes, don't let your lower back muscles take over. So you just find the muscles and contract them, go with the feeling. Another Gypsy King song. Do you feel it, do you feel it? Is it burning? Resist the temptation to quit. Take a little break, put the leg down, tell yourself something nice, pick it up again, and we're doing it together. Bamboleo. Keep lifting. I don't know if we're even. I keep on losing count. We just go for the burn. Okay, hold it. Bring the hands up front. Bring the leg out to the side and lift. Just 20, 2, 3, abs tight. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Take the breaks. If you need to, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and take it down. Okay, again, let's stretch it. Please stay ankle above the opposite knee. Push on the floor behind you, take a deep breath in, tell yourself something nice, exhale, make yourself feel this. Okay, the next one that we're gonna do is hard. Usually when I do it in class, people roll their eyes so loudly that I hear them. Take your legs out to the side. And then turn and face your right leg. Place one hand on the inside and one on the outside. Immediately contract your abs and lean back a little bit. And then take a deep breath in. Lift the right leg up, pulse it up. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, take it down. It was hard, wasn't it? Face the other leg, and if it was easy, perfect. Lift, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's switch again. Deep breath, we'll see because I need it. And lift, two, three, four, Five. Keep your shoulders down, relax your neck. Eight, nine, switch. One. So here, your hip flexors, quads, and your abs are working. That's why this is not easy. Take it down, switch again. One, two, three, four, eight, nine, switch. Last time. Two, three, four, Five. If you feel that one side is easier, work the one that is harder more often. Bring it in. Come the soles of your feet together so you stretch no, hip flexor. I don't know why this is happening. 
Make sure you let in 100% of the fielded power of light through window and shine. Very the nice. There's a commercial. Light I'll pay for Pandora. I don't have the cheap version. Bring it all the way back and then bring it down and hold. And then come up. Again, you're going to come up into down dog. Pull your abs in. Lift the right leg up. And this time, when you come forward, bring the knee across to the other side, and then go back up. That's two. Love this song. Three. Four. Feel free to sing along. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Bring it down. Sit back. Interlace the fingers. Lift. Release it. Ready for the other side? Okay, here we go. Our evil ways. Take the leg all the way up. Again, forward, cross over. Inhale, exhale. Inhale. Really important to keep a steady rhythm of your breathing. Not holding your breath in. Five. Six. Seven, and eight. Bring it down, sit back. That should have been hard. Okay, turn around. Right here. This is gonna be so good. Arms are back here, straight arms. Place your right heel on the mat and bring the left leg up. You're going to go up, pulse twice, bring it down. So that's one, two, three, abs are tight, four, your arms are straight, five, six, seven, eight, nine, hold it up, two, three, Perfect, take it down, and then bring it forward and stretch. You should have felt it in your booty. Okay, switch, left heel down, arms are straight. If your wrists bother you, try doing it on your forearms. Okay, here we go. Up, pulse, down. Two, three, all the way down. Four, five, six, this can go on, eight, nine, hold it up, ten more, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, take it down, stretch, did you feel it, okay, how about the infamous leg circles, those of you that take my classes, you know what the leg circles are, so on one side, just put your head, bring the leg all the way in front of you, keep it straight and circle it, so we're going to be here for a little while, and if you've never done these, they hurt. You're using muscles that stabilize you, muscles that we seldom use. This is where I usually lose count. I count in Italian in my head and then I speak to you in English. Sometimes it just gets all mumbled. Okay, reverse it. Sun is coming out. 30 more, two, ten more, okay hold it, flex your foot, bend the knee a little and press, you're going to feel it right here, keep your abs tight, keep the shoulder relaxed, keep your face relaxed, 
remind yourself that this is good for you and persevere. I am just imagining that I'm somewhere in Spain on a horse, on a beach. Keep going, 40 more, two, four. Good, 30 more. Are you still doing it? Take little breaks if you need to. 20 more. circles, keep the legs straight, it's just pain, just pain in the leg, it's all good, building strength, building muscle endurance, building resilience, beautifying yourself, 10 more I think, Reverse it. Make sure there's circles. Don't avoid going up. I've seen it before where people just do little ovals because going up hurts. Go up, go up, circles. Perfect geometry. You feel it? Yeah, I know you do. I feel it. Hold it, flex your foot, little pulses. By my calculations, we're gonna do 80. Keep going. Together, together, we're doing this. 20 more. 10 more. Turn around on all fours. Round your back. You round your back, you stretch it. And then arch your back. Stretch your abs. Because we did work them. And again, round your back. And then gently move your hips side to side. Feel the stretch in those hip muscles and glutes that we worked really hard right now. And we are not done. And then come down on your forearms like this and place your right leg over your left and just hold. Think good thoughts, tell yourself nice things. Pull your arms up and in, switch. Your leg's shaking, mine are shaking still from what we just did. Take it down, push up on the floor and stretch. It's beautiful, the sun has come up. Look again on your forearms, curl your toes under, right leg over left again. Very dramatic music. Switch. We're going to stand up in a minute. Breathe. And then take it down. And again, stretch. Take it up. Bring your knees out and the feet together. Move both arms to one side. 
and reach so you feel the stretch all the way down to your obliques and then the other side reach and then come back to the middle curl your toes under walk your feet up to your hands clasp your elbows and hold so you feel the stretch in the back of your legs bend your knees Place your hands on your thighs and slowly roll up. I'm going to move my mat out of the way. Get my chair out. Get your chair out. Flat back. That's your starting point. And then take one leg up. You're going to bend the standing leg as you bring the other leg in until the knee is lit. And then you're going to extend the leg and straighten the standing leg. Your back is flat, it does not round an arch. So you want to pull your arms in and lengthen your back. Control the movement and push on the floor with your heel. Lift the leg as high up as you can. Always listening to your body. Try to relax your arms, your neck, and your shoulders. Seven, you can speed it up a little now. Eight, nine, You should be feeling this first on the standing leg. That's the one that's supporting your whole body weight. As you push the floor with your heel, you can track the glutes, and then the other leg goes up. You should feel your glutes and hamstrings. Good, hold the leg up. Now bring the heel in, and then back out. Pull your arms in, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Bring it down and then hang down. Clasp your elbows. Inhale deeply, exhale. Bend your knees again. Hands on your thighs. Push on the legs to come up. We're going to switch. Hands are falling. Okay, other leg up. Abs are tight. And again. Bend the standing leg, bring the knee in, and then lift. Here we go. Keep your back flat. Any discomfort in your back, stop and stretch. Back muscles are always working when you're working the glutes. But try to contract the glutes and relax your back as best as you can. Exhale. Ten more. Two. Three. Four. Relax your neck and shoulders. Bring the foot all the way in. Standing leg should be burning. Your other leg is feeling it too. It's good for you, it's good for you. Stay with it, stay strong. 10 more. Two, three, I'm looking at my dogs. Four, five, Seven, eight, nine, bring the leg down, and again, hang down, clasp your elbows, bend your knees, place your hands on your legs, and then come up, bring the legs out to the side. Okay, for this one, if you want to jump, jump, if you don't want to, just hold your arms out and come up on your toes. So you can be here and coming up on your toes, or you can jump. I'm gonna do 10, three, four. And then hold it, press the legs back. Did you like it? Bring both heels up, use your chair if you need to, Come down low, stay up, take your arms in front or use the chair, press back, stay on your toes. Exhale. Take your arms out, bring it down and up. As 
start down as you can. So as you bring it down and up, you want to make sure that the knees go out to the side, not down here. So you can track the glutes and those muscles rotate your legs out. Yeah, let's do 10 more. One, please, no commercials. Three, four, five, seven, eight, nine. Come all the way up. Use your chair. So when you do this, if you feel it in your knees, then only go down halfway. Otherwise, come up on your toes and keep your heels all the way up. And then take your body all the way down until you touch your heels. And then without doing this, go straight up. And then again, bring it all the way down. Go straight up. Castanets. I am thinking of paella and shrimp with garlic. You should be feeling this, I know I am. Contract the glutes in your abs. 10 more. One, two, ah yes, three, four, five, almost there. Six, seven, eight, touching your abs, nine, ah, last one, stretch, hold it, was it hard, did you feel your quads, your calves, lat muscles, switch, Okay, use your chair for balance. Take your right arm up. Bring your right leg all the way up. And pulse that leg up. So here, your glutes are holding your leg up to the side. Quads, hip flexors are lifting your leg up. The arm is just up to lengthen your spine. Take your arm out to the side. Bring both arms out to the side. and then take it down, okay. Move your chair, arm up, leg out, and lift. Remember when you lift, I should have told you that earlier, don't lean back. Try to lean towards the leg by contracting your obliques. Keep lifting, take the arm out, both arms out. If you need to hang on to the chair, please do. There's always one side where you can balance easier. Not my right side. It's okay, if I do a face plan, just ignore. Pretend it didn't happen. We carry on. Ah, very good, take it down and stretch. So pull the foot up and then press your hips forward. So you feel the stretch from the hip down to the knee and then switch. At Secret, we figured oh out my goodness. Okay, you're going to get rid of your chair, go out to the side, go all the way down, come up on your toes. All the way down, up on the toes again. Ignore the commercial. It's operator error. I being the operator. My internet went off this morning, and I think that's what happened. Rebooting everything. See, I managed to talk over the commercial. All right, take it down to your mat again. Bring your legs in. Take your arms out. Go out, back, and pull in. Breathe out, keep your abs tight as you do 
this. Let's do 20 more. As you pull it in, press your hip down. Release and switch. Release it. Come up on all fours. Again, round your back. And arch your back. As you arch your back, inhale. Bring your chin up and bring your tailbone up. Exhale, pull your abs in, tuck your tailbone. Tuck your chin. Again, inhale, arch. Exhale, down. And then release it to your neutral spine. Sit anywhere this is comfortable for you. Take a deep breath. Fall breath. Inhale, hold your breath in. Tell yourself to be nice. And exhale. Thank you. Have a wonderful rest of the day.